Hello and welcome back to New York Gold. Today I am going to show you a couple of, actually three new pickups I got. I got some uh, Crown Pearl Scale Goldfish and it turns out, I got them in a 40 over here, I guess in a second. They're all male. They're young fish, but I'm going to show you how I figured out that uh, I got three boys. So uh, check it out. Alright, here are two of these guys. Well, what makes them different than regular pearl scales is that big bump on the heads. That's why they're called crown pearls instead of just mouse head or regular pearl scales. But the uh, I got three boys and if you have a keen eye you can kind of see. I don't know if you can see from this video yet or not but there's actually three. There's these two and there's another one down there. I got them. I just set up this 40 for these guys and I put in, I have a couple of veils that came out of the telescope spawn, or three of those. So they're in here chilling with these guys. So we'll see if they, uh, they all get along. So let me show you, I got some stills. Let me show you how and why I, uh, I figured out they were boys. I, would, I, would, I got these with the intent of breeding them, but uh, well, I gotta go get more, I guess. I hope they still have them. Okay. So, uh, hang on a second. I'll show you how I found out. Okay, this is my fancy drawing of a goldfish. Not just any fish, it has to be a goldfish. So when the fish is older and bigger, they get these little white dots on their cheeks called breeding stars. And I guess they would be over here, right on his, on his gill plates. And that's how you know it's a male. The males get those. They don't always get those. This isn't 100%, but if it has it, then it's not a female. And I found more often than not, with young fish, they, well, all males too, but they also get them on their pectoral fins, right here. On the leading edge, you'll see white dots. So that'll be right along here and usually they get that first so if you have a young fish and you want to know if it's male or female if it's showing those signs because sometimes they won't even get the ones in the gill plate but they almost always get them right here they actually do get them on the anal fin also but it's very hard to uh to see but this leading edge of the pectoral fin is a good early indicator of a male fish so let me uh I took some stills, it's easier to see than my crude drawing. Okay, so we'll uh, be back in a minute. I'll show you the pictures. Thank mm -hmm. you. 